Now then the next one. Jyoti Jyoti Parai, last eye. Those who go from brightness to brightness, they are enjoying their life, they are leading very pleasant, peaceful life, they gain everything what they need while enjoying. They also cultivate their way of life, their knowledge and understanding and meritorious deeds for the next life. So without abusing and misusing this life, they maintain this life very gently, lead a righteous way of life without disturbing others. At the same time, they also earn something without hurting others. We can use our income in no harm. Again, we can use our income to support others. So we have completed our life without abusing. We enjoy our life in normal way. As I mentioned earlier, you can have worldly pleasure without violating your basic principle, religious principle. You can entertain your senses. No harm. You never break any precept by doing that. But if you remain fully enjoying by neglecting the other side of it, then life can become miserable again. So you can continue this brightness, brightness to brightness, make life also become very fortunate, very meaningful, very peaceful, if you handle this very carefully. Uh, this is the simple discourse the Buddha has given for all of us to think very seriously, very, very meaningful, easy to understand, and not difficult to practice within our capacity. Again I repeat, all over the world, the human beings are categorized or classified into four groups. One group from darkness to darkness, you know the meaning. Another group from darkness to brightness. Another group from brightness to darkness. Another one, brightness to brightness in very few ways, not even five percent. <laughs>